Hi everyone, Jeremy Reynolds here from Fab Tax at Chloe Valley Park. Uh, I've met with hundreds and I dare say thousands of tax clients over the years and I get asked the same question and so do all our team members every single year and I want to talk to you about this. The question is for that person that's always done their tax themselves. They've told me, and the conversation goes something like this. So they are interested, otherwise we wouldn't be having the conversation to begin with. But they say to me, I've, I've always done my tax myself. Mine's really basic. Uh, I don't have many deductions. Uh, it's just a matter of submitting it. Why should I really see, see Fab Tax to do my tax for me? I'm quite comfortable doing it myself, and it's worked out okay in the past and I say fantastic that's good that you haven't had any potential problems with your tax that you're aware of so there's there's a number of different issues which I want to identify here and give you clarity now first of all if yours is very basic and I dare say let the fab tax professionals be the judge of what's basic and not uh, be, let them identify some things in there to see where it sits in the in the the costing framework but but I dare say if it does work out it's very basic it means it's going to be more cost effective it'll be of a lower price point for starters but let's dispel let's talk about this are you an accountant do you have qualifications in accounting taxation well, no so yours is very basic you haven't any problems in the past so let's pose some valid questions there. How do you know that you haven't that there aren't any problems looming? Just because something wasn't identified in the past doesn't mean that it won't be identified this year by the ATO. Something that you've missed, something you've miscalculated. And then if that's the case, they may well look at previous tax returns as well. So you have a minor problem then that now can get multiplied over numerous years. But let's hold that thought for just a moment. Second of all, there is no real way to know that you're getting the most out of your tax. Well, I get the, the, the follow-up question might be, well, I get about the same amount of money back each year. So what's your measuring stick for that? Yes, you can only get the money back from which you have been taxed. But let's say that you end up getting a, a small amount back and it's less than $1,000 refund each year. I would pose the question to each person, how much have you actually been taxed for that year? Is there potential, and there is, that you aren't claiming enough things to begin with? So the evidence would be if we did the tax return and found higher levels of deductions. Now, even if we only, you only got $59 or $79 back, you'd still be at break even point. However, if we could get you hundreds or thousands of dollars back, it would be a worthwhile investment. The other thing to consider as well is not just, a, I've mentioned here that there's certain things that you may not have been claiming. But what about the things that you are claiming? Because you've heard, you know, I can claim things for my vehicle, I can claim things for these certain work expenses and these and this way. But are you claiming them by the best method? Many people don't realise that, for instance, with your vehicle, there's different methods of deductions. Are you doing utilising the best possible for your situation? It's hard for you to say, knowing that you don't have the grounding and framework of being an accountant or a tax agent in this case. So there's, there is potential that you're not claiming the right way and therefore not being able to get as much of a refund. There's also potential that there's complete deductions that you're missing out completely. You go, well, I didn't pay for them. The third concept is, there might be things that, yes, you go, your deductions are accurate, well done. But what if there were certain things in your business that you, in your business, and let's just say, or in your household for the, 
for the individual. There's things in your household that you could be doing differently, and because you didn't make those purchases, you can't claim them. Potentially, there could have been some of those things that you could have allocated spend a little bit different on to help you out. Or you got that, that wonderful conversation with someone that said, buy this, it's tax time, and there was nothing to claim from it anyway. So you're spending your money, and there's no tax deduction associated with it. Expensive, expensive exercises. So, on this, for a very low cost point, we're able to do this process for you. It's reviewed, it's detailed, and we can look for people in your, look for deductions. So hypothetically, you're a, working in a particular profession. We'll look at what other professions that other people in that are generally claiming. We'd ask you a line of questions that goes above and beyond purely ticking boxes. This is key. Hypothetically, you're an electrician, but PAYG, you work for another company. We're not going to just go through the standard list. We will make sure that we ask, what type of electrician? What does your day-to-day -day role involve? Because there's a lot of people within the broad framework of being an electrician that have very, very different occupations. They have very, very different, they use different tools. They do, some travel, some don't travel. Some do away work, some work locally. This is going to need a personalised approach to dealing with these things. Second of all, the quest back to the original question, my tax return is really basic, I've always done it myself. Let's say something goes wrong, or even on a lighter level, nothing's gone wrong, yet there's a line of questionings or, or inquiries that comes from the ATO. So the tax office. If you do your tax yourself, you have to deal directly with those questions and provide appropriate answers. Now, we're not assuming anyone's done anything wrong, but at the same time, it can be extremely confronting, it can be extremely stressful, and it can be extremely time consuming having to now get on the phone, talk to the ATO about things that you don't know about, and now the person starts, you start second guessing yourself. What have I done wrong? Did I do this right? What if I give the wrong answer? This is confusing. And now your time, your energy has been spent in the wrong way. And I know for a fact that you're all really busy people out there. So if you have your tax completed with, uh, with FAB, those questions, those inquiries from the ATO will get dealt with, will get vetted, will get talked to, and will actually go through FAB. This is really important because we are representing you to the ATO. Sure, we might come back to you with some questions and get some clarification, but we will manage that process and talk to them on your behalf, which is really, really important. Another note being, what if there's you miss something or there was a glitch because you've done it on some software, which is you have it at home, you've done it on your computer, and there's been an issue. And for some reason, your refund now hasn't been paid. Now you're calling up the ATO, finding out what's going on, getting on hold on queues, not understanding what they're talking about, more uncertainty for you. However, again, if you're dealing with FAB, we do that for you. So it doesn't matter if you're coming in as a somewhat low income earner or someone with little to many deductions or little to many expenses that you've incurred throughout the year, which you might look at claiming, or you earn a significant amount of money, it's these additional things that are really important. So in the last video, I made sure to talk about that experience, sitting down with you and helping you through and getting to know you as a client. But it goes beyond that. The relationship exists and you will have FAB working for you and assisting you while you're, after that appointment's finished. Again, we're a full service business. So you could be at work today, having done your tax return a week ago, and a question from the ATO comes in. While you're working, this is something that we would deal with, either via phone, via email, while you can get on with your day-to-day -day life. How's that value for you? What we will also do as well is, let's say, we talked about this before, about everything being normal. Let's say we did have that problem that came up. We're doing this year's tax for you, so you bit the bullet, we've had this conversation, you think, yeah, actually, uh, really affordable tax returns, I, I like what you're doing, um, let's take care of this year's for me. And we notice a series of deductions for you. 
we go through them and you oh, I've never claimed that before okay so have you spent money on this did you purchase this did you do this yes I did how long have you had that expense for and just for the case of this it was a mobile phone that was utilized a certain percentage for work well I've been in the same business for the last five years and it's expensive if it was a worthy amount and so forth and, and then there was another one there was another deduction that wasn't made I've never claimed that we have the processes in place so if it's cost effective we, we, we can amend previous year's tax so therefore it might be your first year with us you might have all of your tax returns up to date but if they haven't been done to the suitable level we can review them we can go to the ATO and amend those tax returns to get you refund that you may not have got before now, it, this might be you, it might be other people, so some people will be surprised by this, other people won't. Some people don't claim anything. They submit their tax return, it's like, let's just get this over and done with. Well, if you wanna get it over and done with, we can do it really quickly for you, we can make it efficient, we can make it for, you know, and it might surprise you, quite an enjoyable experience. But then, we can make sure that we have the sharp pencil, that we find those deductions. And all you have to do is be willing to answer those questions for us. I'm sure you will because it can eventuate to money in your pocket. So if you're posing the question to yourself today, uh, I don't claim very much, I earn a medium, a medium income, low to medium, I'm not sure it's worthy of me going to an accountant, I've done it myself, I haven't had any problems, it doesn't mean that it's the best solution. And you might be thinking, it doesn't necessarily mean that it's the best way, the most effective way to get you what you need. Doing it yourself as well, you're not gonna get that coaching as well to find out for the next period of time what you should be doing differently as well. You can have history repeating itself and quite naively thinking everything is okay. It might not be okay. But because there hasn't been a catalyst for you or there hasn't been an event which is triggered either by the ATO or something external that's raised some alarm bells, you won't know. However, when you work with, with us, Fab, we can identify these things for you. We will help you through them. We will make sure that, yes, you have that great experience, but we will be there to support you all year round with your tax and not just for the hour that you sit down with us and go through your tax return. And how do we know that people are happy with this service? Because most of our clients refer their friends and family on to us immediately because we've helped them so much, we've saved them money, we've removed the stress from us, and we ensure that we can do that for you and your household too. So if you'd like to make an appointment, please walk into our branch, one of our branches, wherever you see those A-frames, today I'm at Clove Valley Park, or, or make a phone call inquiry, and we're happy to field any of your questions, uh, no matter how simple or complex they are, we've got the right person to deal with those. Please call us on 1300 541 777 so we can help you today. Now, I'm Jeremy Reynolds from Fab Tax, and we look forward to helping you with your tax this year and in the future.